for you. Will you answer my question? Callie. What? It's Callie! <laughs> May you die alone and silent. Well, you can talk, then. Your people don't originate from Earth, do they? My people are the r, &R. And they are telepathic. Guards, don't speak or make a sound. Why can't you read our minds? Because you are not telepathic. Could I read yours? You could receive my thought if I wished you to. Blake, we're running out of time. I am from the planet Iron. I was sent from there to aid the freedom fighters of this planet. We will regard ourselves as hostages against Blake's return. Oh, thank you, Callie. What a clever idea. Blake will return. You can bet your life on it. In fact, you've just bet both our lives on it. Move back to the flight deck. Look at the burns on her hand. She must be in agony. I will kill you if you do not obey. What was all that about? Better keep her sedated. I'm locked up or dumped. You should have never brought her on the ship. My people have a saying. A man who trusts can never be betrayed, only mistaken. Life expectancy must be fairly short among your people. <laughs> She was ashamed to go back to her own people because she had survived when the rest of the freedom fighters were massacred. It's ironic, isn't it? She was the only one of us who wasn't a convicted criminal. She's alive. I knew she wasn't dead. No, you didn't. No, I didn't. I'm going to tell God. Treatment and interrogation. That doesn't sound too promising. She's alive. That's all that matters. Well, there may be a little pain, a little discomfort, but you will remember. I will tell you nothing. I cannot return to my people. I have failed. Then stay with us. Thank you.